today is a special day and I want you to come with me. Not only will I be going to one, but I'll be going to two professional football games in one day. I know you got to check out the swag first. Uh, So as you can tell, first game, Arlington Renegades. Uh, The back says, uh, don't just stare. Google me, Sneaky G, man. That's kind of what the back says. Uh, So here I am with Mama Boss. Um, Obviously, my ride and die, literally. Uh, This is the inside of Choctaw Stadium. Uh, They got multiple food food vendors out there. You can get any type of food barbecue. Uh, Today, we went with hot dogs. Oh, and there's also a Starbucks in there too. So you can get Starbucks, uh, but you gotta go off of that. Anyway, so there's our seats. Um, we got great seats, by the way. Um, shout out to our uh, ticket guy, because we're right underneath the awning. I mean, I don't know if you can tell, but uh, I don't need to be working on my tan anytime soon. So, um, no matter where you sit, you got good seats. Especially sporting events, and I always got to wear the SL. Because I am definitely a fan. I got that nap in. Time for game number two. Frisco Fighters down in the Cocoa Arena. We've been season ticket holders. This is now our third season. Let's go Fighters. Now in this stadium, this is where the Dallas Stars, their you know Dallas' professional hockey team, practices. So when you walk in, you get to see a little bit of the history of the Dallas Stars. Which I think is kind of amazing. Um, now, of course, that's a replica Stanley Cup that they've won. And today was military night. So they were handing out free hats. And uh, if I'm saying nothing, I was able to get an extra one. Um, just fine. Whatever. Get to I mean, look. Look at that field. It's a 50 yard field. Fast pace football. got him when we go to sporting events i swear now because i'm a season ticket holder and i legitimately sit in the front row i get vip access what you're looking at is the choctaw lounge i highly recommend this is the only way to go to an indoor football league game the choctaw lounge it allows you to get a meal I mean, you're basically paying for a meal talk about people's moms or, or nothing like that but if you keep it professional in a sense oh my god 
And sometimes, I actually, the last game, I had a player come up to me and be like, I remember you from last year. And I'm like, and I'm still here. And here they are lining up uh, for the field goal. Might I add, if you catch the ball during the game, you get to take it home. And yes, we have a couple game balls. We do. Um, oh, and, and it also too, uh, at times, refs, they will give you a coin that they use on the coin toss. And uh, I got a couple of those as well. So here we go. What I've been waiting for, and trust me, even though I'm tired, when I go to these games, I get a second burst of energy. Towards me? Oh no, not this time. Oh, and I forgot to mention when you go to these games, you meet some awesome people and make new friends. Hey, hey, it's going down tonight. Hey, we need to score 64 to nothing. If you want to pay individual games, that's fine too. But man, look, I mean, I'm like, I'm right there. I'm right by the player's bench. I'm right on the field. Rest assured, I was talking crap to 13 all night. Not only 13, but when we were, when we had the ball, I was talking some smack to 21. I was like, don't get burnt. Yeah, he ended up getting burnt. Now look, this is after a touchdown, and that's our MVP right there. Uh, T.J. Edwards, that's a bad man right there. Now here's another play after a touchdown from a player who caught a deep pass. And, uh, no, actually, he ran that back. He ran that uh, back for the, from the kickoff, my mistake. I mean, look, I'm like right there. always I gotta rep my guys I gotta rep my guys man ESF for life baby ESF it's in the fans <laughs> oh man I might have to call EA Sports on that so this was a dominating performance uh, by the physical fighters and to be fair it's that man right there of the first of And I was so lucky now to be a close man with the head coach. This is what he has to say about the world. Okay. <laughs> this is my yeah. Oh, 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 and I 
but I, I remember last time we spoke, you said over and over again, they're going to try and go for 50 50 yeah, miles. Yeah, yeah, and, I, and you were coaching on the sidelines. They're going to take their shot. They're going to take their shot. Yeah. And at times they did. What keys did they give you on their offense that you kind of predicted what they were going to do? Uh, just run. He's a, he's a, he's a, a first team only player. So uh, when you have a guy like that and you start alone, who else are you going to go to? He's a guy named a player. He's on our team to be doing the same thing. So just understanding the game and what to watch him for, watch him for, watch him for, and just seeing the tendency. I'll say you got a lot of people waiting for you today, and I got you early, so I'm gonna let you go crazy. Go fight. Yes, sir. Okay, so I challenge him to Madden, yeah. and we'll come up with the terms and conditions later. Yeah. But also, when he scores his first touchdown, you gotta give me a shit. You gotta give me one of these. You gotta give me one of these. Hey, One and one. I'll take it. Man, y'all be safe and be good.